All right. We're playing some Resident Evil 2. Uh, Claire's version this time. All right. Uh, I forget what the difference is between uh, disc one and disc two, or uh, scenario A and scenario B. In the midst of the T virus outbreak so, in Raccoon City, there's gonna be jump scares. Leon Kennedy succeeded in escaping from the city following his encounter with one of the only other survivors, a woman named Ada. Ada! A spy seeking the deadly G virus. However... Recap of the first section. Ada! Ada! Leon was not the sole survivor of the incident. A girl named Claire Redfield was in town on business of her own. She came to uncover the mysterious circumstances of her brother's disappearance. Chris Redfield, a member of the Star's Alpha Team. Only now, her mission has become quite simple. Survive. Basic survival within the nightmare that was once Raccoon City. Or you could have just said it the way I said it. And paused really long, even longer than that. Looks like no suspension on that thing. Just no moving up and down. Come on. Right, we start in a different spot. <sighs> I'm finally here. Are we though? Taxic, go, go. I said that before. We get it. Why do you bite me? Guys, I'm a maniac. Why do you bite me? Why do you bite me? Still, it's still my favorite. Hello. Donuts. Is anyone here? Hello. Uh, hello. Get out! Look, I'm sorry I bothered you, okay? Just don't come any closer. Are you listening? Ha. Get down! Uh... No, not yet. Ah, it's here. Down. <gasps> Quickest deal ever kill a zombie we without a shotgun. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. There. Without pointing. Okay. Don't walk, shuffle. Went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah. First day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. That's a contact thing she never said. He works in stars. Maybe you'll know him. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it. Surprise at a cop's car. And then the zombie shows up. You okay? Seat belts. Still in one piece. Okay. Magic school bus, stars, anything. Seat belts, everyone. Because that thing's cruising on the uh, main street. Explosions. Claire! Leon! I'm okay. Head to the station. 
station. I'll meet you there. Okay. And we go. The other direction. At the same time, at the same place. You have to survive this nightmare to know the true end. Ah! I'm going right instead of left. Okay. When I first played this, uh, okay. Nope. Nope. Uh, whenever they got moves around like this, I was surprised, to say the least. It took me a long time to get to this point. So, oh, where am I? Okay, I need to unlock a door. Oh, I'm in the back. Oh, so that's where I gotta go, the locked door, because that's where the... Okay, I'm remembering things now. Or... Okay. You get out before you get trapped. Ah, oh, crap, I'm trapped. Ah, oh, you dick. Right here. This is where Ada comes in. It goes down to the basement. No, that's for the... Oh, I remember, okay. Yeah, uh, right? No, no. Okay. So this whole area, there's nothing in it. And it's very short to the police station. Ha. Huh. Perfect start. I will take it. Oh, they're up against the door. And once you open it, they come running through. I'm trying to think ahead, and there's so much. All, all I have is familiar places and not actual uh, knowledge of what's gonna be there. Let's, let's go on this side first. Girl? Yes. Okay. No herbs. Okay, it should not be a helicopter yet. Or, or there's a helicopter yet. Hey, get over here! Hurry! I can't set her down. I'll drop you a rope ladder. Grab onto it. Come on. Just a little more. Yeah. Get off me! Stay back! Don't come any closer! Oh. Submachine gun. Shoots the helicopter now. Damn. So that's what happened to the helicopter. All right, I was right there when it all happened. Wasn't shot in any in any specific way uh, at all. Nope. Still need a thing. Why was there one that, uh, uh... Crap. Puzzles are different. Uh, okay. Okay. Birds? It's gonna be birds. No birds. Oh, birds. Uh... Yeah, dead. Okay. Bullets. Uh, Damn it. Oh, lockpick. Uh, don't. 
What? Is there another bird? Should be. Uh, no, I can't go that way. I could, mm. let's unlock this first. Should be a bunch of herbs. Yeah, uh, the bottom one's probably locked. I'll leave those there for now. I'm trying to think. What okay. ammo? What do I need? Oh, 13 bullets. Hey, there it is. No, not that way. Two fall down. Oh, she fall steps back, but she shoots. All right. I need to get in that safe. Oh, I don't remember the code though. <laughs> the angle just okay I think they're all dead take that and I have four okay I'm assuming a bunch of zombies that way Mr. Zombie on the floor Okay, let's try to save. Seems to be <clears throat> nothing of use. A hey, bullets. Red herb. Nope, just a regular ass green one. Come on. Uh to uh nope I forgot so we'll deal with that later crap uh is it still the diamond key hearts it's a heart key so it was never a diamond key okay let's turn off the water turn on the water Turn on the water, put out the fire, grab the stuff. Let's see. Water. I have a bad feeling here. All I can think of is the opening on the remake. Or when you go through there on the remake. Getting chased by Mr. X. Alright. First things first. Uh, this, then ammo, then ruby. In the thing. Grenade rounds. Anything else? Let's leave the ammo for. Oh. Cutscene. Great. It begins.
That's the hallway I'm going into. It's Mr. X without a hat. Great, I didn't... It collapsed, I could no longer go that way. Great. Alright, do I have... Can I dodge? Yo. Oh no. Stop it! I don't know his range. Does it? Is it room to room? Sun spawning? I don't. Can we go broken? Can't further. Why? The door is broken. Can't go any further. There's no choice to take out the wall. Oh, I gotta blow up the wall. That means I need probably the explosives in this. That it will probably be in the stars room. Oh, great. Uh, I don't have everything to do. I'm trying to grab everything before I go any further. Because I believe there's a thing that happens in here. Fine, I'll take the card. Where's the shotgun? Oh, I know. Ah. No. Great. I didn't want to do that. My ass kicked. All right, the receptionist room. Uh, all right, I accidentally moved one of the stones. Yeah, I put it there. We read this before. Get the rubies, two places. Uh, one in a fireplace, the other in a place I don't currently remember. Nope. Nope. Stop it! Won't need that yet. Uh, yeah. Sounds like a, what I should do at this point. Uh, I need the health. Don't want the code. What's the code? I'll find a letter. Zombies. So. Mm. Okay. I'm trying to figure out... Okay, I should unlock the thing that's over here. That sounds like a lot of them. No way. Two more. Still one more. Oh, that's where I had to go. Ah, shit. A lot of bullets. Just 
fall. Okay, now I can go downstairs, use the thing, but I also want to go this way. So I can lockpick the thing. Oh, right. Everything's electronically locked because I have a card key. Okay. Card key, computer, unicorn, medallion. What? Nice. I have enough. Yes. Come on. Okay, next is the fountain. Key, the a key of some sort, spade. All right, that means waiting room would be the best option. Good wait. Ah, uh, uh, no. Best option is library because I want to open the small key drawer. So hopefully it's something helpful. If not, then... Because if it's like the Matilda, uh, the, the burst shot gun thing, I might... What? Crap. Great. Right. Does that mean, I guess what I did in Leon's playthrough failed now. Uh, I don't need to go upstairs yet. Okay, this should be outside the stars room. Yes, come on. Lame. So lame. Let's try a grenade launcher. That was not as big area as I hoped. Nice. Kicks it like a soccer ball. Anything? Anything else? Alright. Down the end of this hallway. We're we supposed to chase Sherry. Anything? Oh, come on. So there is nothing on this playthrough. Uh, stars, office. I feel like that would progress the story and it's not quite what I want to do just yet but I should hey you don't need the key for the story that was obvious no zombies mr. X Do I have enough space? Leon. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not going to find your brother here after all. Oh, right. 
I found him. He's in this book. It's Winnie the Pooh. Uh, turn into zombie. Mansion. The events of Resident Evil 1. Going to Europe. Chill. Got it. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. And use it precisely once. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Ah, uh, come on. Give me the... Keep... Uh, I have a bad feeling because I can't open that. So that means, does it mean like I made this playthrough a lot harder? <sighs> because I took all the things with Leon. No, uh, probably. Nothing. All right. I don't think there's anything else in here. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. Oh, an email. I mean, a fax mail. Sweet, two copies. One for each of us. Uh, Rocket City Police Department, Stars Division, as per your request, you have conducted our internal investigation and discovered the following information. Regarding the G-Virus currently under development by Umbrella Inc., so far it is unconfirmed that the G-Virus even exists... We're continuing with our investigation regarding the regarding Mr. Brian Irons, chief of the Raccoon City Police. Irons has allegedly received a large sum of funds and bribes of Umbrella over the years. He was apparently involved in the cover-up of the Mansion Lab case, along with several other incidents in which I believe I read this before, but I don't remember, so I'm reading it through anyways. In which Umbrella appears to have direct involvement. Mr. Irons has been arrested under suspicion and of uh, two se okay, suspicion of a repay and two separate accounts during his years as a university student. He underwent psychiatric evaluation as a result of the charges, in, but he was released on going on circumstantial evidence as well as his phenomenal academic standing. So as such, extreme caution, caution has or is advised when dealing with them. Jack Hamilton, Section Chief. I guess I did not read this because I don't remember that. Cool. None of the things he did, though. Yeah, fuck. Okay, so I'm assuming Mr. X shows up. Or zombies. I cleared your way. Wait, wait. Do the thing I should have been doing. Ah. Nice. Second time knifing any character in this game. First one being... Uh, the stars member at the beginning of Leon's playthrough. Wait. Okay. There is no. Uh, I guess I, I did take a like. I have a bad feeling. I uh, I'm not sure if what you did in the first. Or Leon's playthrough. And scenario A affects it significantly, but I know at one point it does. If you take the submachine gun, Claire doesn't get it. But if you. Or if you take the submachine gun and the extra pockets, Claire doesn't get any of them. 
Hey. Oh. Come on. And uh, that's if you load Claire's and Claire B. So, so I know I won't be able to get the submachine gun in this playthrough, but I will get the extra inventory slots. So, at the very least, that's a plus. Hold, hold, so I can have hold, hold so much things in it. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, come on, I didn't push it far enough. Okay, I don't have the room, but it, do this now. I need to go downstairs. Oh, shit, I should just went to the reception area up here. Whatever. Huh. The other one, I need to find a lighter. Otherwise, I won't be able to burn it. The fireplace one. Yeah, diamonds. Diamonds for the rookie's office. And I should have the combination for the other office. There might be like five zombies here. Or zero. Can't pick it up. Okay. 